Hello farms, how are you all doing? I believe great. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening and good night depending on where you are. And please, if you're yet to subscribe to my YouTube channel, can you click on the red subscribe button and also turn on your notification button for our latest and newest updates. So as we all know, today is October 1st, Nigeria Independence. So my question is this, for those of us that are still, you know, killing themselves or fighting for one Nigeria, for those that still refer to themselves as Nigerians, my question to them is, is today actually, is, it, is today actually worth celebrating? Is today worth celebrating? We are going to find that out. You see, Nigeria was colonized by the British and had an independence in 1960. What were the reasons for this colonization? What were the reasons for this colonization? You know, back then as a child, I've always believed that colonization was to bring in development. The reason for colonization was to bring in development and growth into Africa and some other parts of the world. And I'm very sure so many had the same thoughts. Well, we're all wrong because after 60 years of Nigeria independence, things has gone worse. And I should explain to you that the colonial masters brought in the colonial trick to get what they wanted. So the simple reason why Nigeria was colonized by the British was to, you know, get their resources. The main reason was to, you know, was because of their resources. That's the, that's the reason. There isn't any two ways about that. It's so clear. It's so clear that it's because of that resources. Now, the main issue is... If we have all realized that Nigeria was created for the interest of some people to the detriment of many, of so many, of millions, why then are we still fighting? Why then are we still killing ourselves to still keep that name Nigeria? Why are we still fighting for one Nigeria? If something is not working for you, if something is not working for you, then you try something else. So as it stands, Nigeria isn't working for millions. And that's why the indigenous people of Nigeria, like the um, IPO, that the indigenous people of Biafra at Odudua, are seeking for their freedom. You know, self-determination is everyone's right. So, so many are really ready to go back to their roots. Many millions are ready to go back to their roots because Nigeria isn't working. Nigeria isn't working. So, for you to have realized that Nigeria was created for the interest of some people, then you should fight for yourself, um, you should fight for your rights. You should fight to decolonize Nigeria because it wasn't created for the interest of the indigenous people. It was created for the interest of some people. So, you should try to fight or we should try to fight to decolonize that name Nigeria for our own interest. For own freedom so so many are ready to go back to their roots and so many are really fighting for their freedom well my own take is the government cannot stop anybody or the government cannot stop people fighting for their rights you know they may try they may try but they can't so the government cannot stop anybody it is the people's voice that matters. The people's voice matters. So that is fans. Let's interact on our comment section. Kindly make your comment. Drop your comment on our comment section. Air your views. Let's know what you feel, what you think. And please, if you're yet to subscribe to my YouTube channel, kindly click on the red subscribe button and also turn on your notification button for our latest and newest updates. Until I come your way again, remain blessed.